The archers are getting serious today. It's day two of the competition, qualification rounds are over, and we realized we didn't have time to give you the highlights yesterday. So sit tight and we'll give you the scoop. Two young newcomers came out with a surprisingly loud bang today in qualification round. Francis Gael, a 17-year-old, came out raking fourth out of the top eight today in competition. Also Miranda Leaf, an 18-year-old who just graduated high school, ended up placing third for her skills in individual rounds for recurve. On that note, the Americans completely dominated the compound rounds today, with three American men leading in their rounds, and then another three women leading in the top four for individuals. Another score for the USA team today, as Brady Ellison followed suit with his two previous World Cup titles, scoring first in the recurve rounds and placing first in the top eight. Talk about skill. Those were some pretty incredible highlights from yesterday's qualifications. Now, let's take a step into today's semifinal events where we'll see two matches, eight rounds, and 16 bows shoot for the win. You had your competition today. We just ended up going through the semifinals. You unfortunately didn't make it through. However, you did play a good game. How did you feel about your game today um, in this event? Um, well, I definitely started out strong this morning, so I was, you know, really uplifted. I'm like, okay, let's go and do it and get it done. And uh, then the second match, I struggled through it, and um, you know, I felt like I shot good shots, but they just didn't go where they're supposed to. And I guess that happens. You have to kind of bite the bullet and take what you get and move on. So. <laughs> Earlier this morning, Canada and France were neck and neck during the semifinals. However, later during the quarterfinals, Canada came out in the lead. Our compound team was very, very strong. I think we're having um, the men and women both in the semifinals. So we're really happy about that. And the men did really well today. They shot a Canadian record. Let's just say it was very lucky. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we had that for ourselves today. Yes. The, the French team actually gave us a gift, and I'm about to run out and buy a lottery ticket. Yeah. <laughs> there were many big hitters out in the archery fields today, but there were four teams specifically that stood out from amongst the rest. Those teams were India, UK, France, and USA, all which will be competing in most of the events. Some individuals from Italy and China also ended up showing success on the field and represented for their teams. Chang Ming, um, how did you feel about the competition today? I have performed at a um, normal level, not too high, not too low. Even though many men and women were eliminated today during semifinals, they say they'll be there tomorrow at finals to show support for their friends from different countries. Brittany Shiflett, Archery World Cup.